Okay, we're I'm starting this video out. We're in um, this um, drafting program. It's a free program you can get online. It's called Delta CAD. I've got some previous videos up on it. Um, I want to go to File and um, Import a picture that I took. So I click on here, Image File to Clipboard. Sorry about the wait here. This is my my computer's being finicky. Okay, so here's the two of the pictures I just took, the JPEG files. So I'm gonna hit click the one one of the two. It's a front shot of a 69 AMX, and it comes up as a square with an X through the square. So I'm just clicking in the middle. And so the other X right here is, is trying to keep on, you know, make copies of that same, same image. So I go up here and hit escape. Okay, so I've got the image. I go to view and you can hit view all to see. The, so that's the whole picture that I took. But I want to. I want to. I'm drawing just the AMX. I want to. I want to get a CAD version of the that AMX. So I'm going to view previous. Okay. So right now we're on a layer called default. That's what it comes up standard. You could pick different names for layers, but it's that's what it's on, and and the color is white. So it's going to be a little hard to see. But you click line, and it's on how it's highlighted red. It's um, select any two points. So I'm going to just start to start tracing over this. So I go there to there, there, trying to get the the letter A in there. So if you go close to the endpoint, it it acts like a magnet. It it clicks the endpoint of that line. To there, there, over. Now I could have picked a horizontal line, but I'm just I'm just eyeballing it here. So I'm almost got the A. So I'm going to stop here. So you get the idea. Just keep on clicking away lines, and you can go up here and you can pick a. A vertical line or a horizontal line if you like if I wanted to do this horizontal I click that and then magnet attaches there and see how it's drawing a line it, it haven't completed a line until you click on it so I can go right there but I'm going to stop it for now okay here's the uh, the, the finish up of um, the grill that I'm trying to do with the AMX. Um, one suggestion, whenever you're drawing, is whenever you get your your lines going, and to get a, a crisp corner, um, try to go to um, Edit Menu, or excuse me. edit and then this right here is um, create a corner fillet, fillet to a point versus chamfer or, or round over but you want it to the corner and you just pick pick a line and pick a second line and hit enter and um, it'll it'll trim those those two lines down to a corner um, I think I'm tempted to draw the the horizontal grills on this thing too. Um, um, I'm going to have to verify. I, I also want to verify the size of this thing to the original. 
and whatever this distance is right here I'll, I'll take it and um, scale it up or down as the case may be to get it to precise measurements all right that's it for now bye okay here's the continuation of this is um, I went out and measured the AMX emblem and this is what I came up with that um, the grill itself is um, and this is I'm not showing it but th there's a there's a rectangle around the AMX so it's one inch is high one inch high and five and a half inches wide so I, I threw a dimension on this and we're at 2.06 so I just need to scale this down I'm going to scale it down like by half so what you have to do you have to go up here and um, you have to go up and select select the items you want to to scale put a, put a rectangle around them and then they all get highlighted showing that you selected it and then you go up here and you SC scale them and you enter the scale factor and I'm going 0.5 whoops 0.5 and enter and so it, it scaled it down by a half hit escape a couple times to get out of that view all and see it it's a little bit over 1.03 so it's close enough for government work please go out a little ways you hit the arrow up go out a little ways and you can you can um, so the check double check let's throw a, a dimension dimension we'll do the um, horizontal horizontal dimension I click to that point to this point and then you you eyeball in the center where it's going to place the um, where the dimension is going to be click it and it's 5.8 where it's supposed to be five and a half so I'm going to trim it down a little bit to get five and a half but um, that's that's our full scale AMX so I'm going to go ahead and save this file down and my goal here I think is I'm going to go send it to that um, send cut send to try to um, to have this this AMX cut into a shape then I'm going to cre try to recreate that um, that emblem on the front of the car. All right, bye. Just a couple words about um, I've got my DXF file made now, and just a matter of what I'm going, planning on doing is sending it to this um, send cut send which is a, a metal cutting service. I, I have not used this service yet. I've, I've heard it mentioned before on this other channel, um, Super Fast Matt. Uh, I've mentioned him before, but if you get a chance, um, check out his videos. They're very, he's very sarcastic, so it's pretty entertaining and pretty, pretty smart guy. Uh, so that was my, this is my plans on this. I'm gonna um, create this AMX um, emblem that goes on the front grill. I'm, I'm going to try to create my own front grill and so I'm going to send this off to them and it's going to be approximately one inch by five and a half inches and I'm going to put a, a couple holes on, on the left and right side of it so I can run a, a screw in there to attach it to the grill. So it's going to be a homemade grill and we'll see how it goes. All right. I'll talk to you later.
Um, if you like um, any of this content, um, take a thought about uh, subscribing. I appreciate it. And any comments would be very much appreciated. Right. Bye.